There's a new Star Wars game that just came out, and literally nobody's talking about it. And when I say no one's talking about it, I genuinely mean that. So in case you missed it, the game I'm talking about is a new Minecraft Star Wars story game, where you play through an adventure of a Padawan Jedi, learning what it takes to actually become a Jedi, and with that, you're getting the creation of lightsabers, the creation of the astromech droids, all the things that you would love to do in a Star Wars game, you're getting here. You're actually getting to become a Jedi for the first time ever in a video game. And you know, maybe people aren't talking about this game because it is a Minecraft game, or maybe, you know, it's just a Star Wars game they're not interested in because of the Minecraft, you know, gimmicks to it. But in my opinion, this game is actually really, really well made. And I think if you don't give it a shot, you're actually missing out. I've said this before in my past video about the game, but when I was a kid, I dreamed of becoming a Jedi. I thought about, you know, creating a lightsaber and changing the hilt in the kyber crystal and finding the kyber crystal and doing all of those things, creating my own astromech droid and changing the colors on him, doing all those things. I loved R2-D2 as a kid. I loved Anakin as a kid. So I always thought watching his path to the Jedi was really cool. Well, now we've got a game that finally lets you do it, but it's just not in like Star Wars Survivor graphics. It's in Minecraft graphics, but that also pays for itself. The game is only $10. You'd buy it on the Minecraft store. So it's not some $70 game like Jedi Survivor, which by the way, was amazing. But you're not even expecting that here. You're expecting a Minecraft game. From the surface, it doesn't look like much, but as soon as you unpack this game and start the adventure world, your mind is kind of blown. You get the chance to find a kyber crystal, create your own lightsaber, create your own astromech droid, go through Jedi training, go to the Jedi Council at the Jedi Temple, talk to other Jedi like Anakin, Ahsoka, Obi-Wan, Yoda, literally whoever you want. You get to train against other Jedi and fight them and climb their ranks and leaderboards. And it's just really fun. You can go on missions with Anakin, missions with Ahsoka, you can do all sorts of stuff in this galaxy. But I think that it's not getting talked about enough because it just really isn't marketed that well. I actually found out about this game because I was looking at lists of games coming out for Star Wars in the future, and friends and I were talking about upcoming games, and someone had mentioned that this Path of the Jedi DLC for Minecraft was getting released. Fast forward some time, finally get a chance to buy the game, it's only 10 bucks like I said, I start playing it, and I just fell in love with it. It's been super fun, the force jumps and everything are super fun. Like I said, creating your own lightsaber and everything, that was a dream of mine as a kid, and so it's finally brought to life, and I also love Minecraft growing up, so this really helps put it all together, make a really fun time. Um, it's especially fun to play, you know, talking to your friends at the same time, creating your lightsabers together, all of that stuff. It seems like you're going through the ropes of being a Jedi with your friends, and that feels special, and Minecraft's always felt that way. But let me know if you guys played the game, I truly enjoy it so far. Hope you guys all have an amazing day. May the force be with you always.